Good morning everyone and today is the second day of our three-day trip from the university and right now we are going to have breakfast in the hotel if you haven't seen our rooms and the first day please check it out and today we have big plan we're going to another city i think and museum there so let's go together <laughs> So right now we are at the city that's called Zhangjiagang. It's not really a popular city in China. I've never heard of it before. Uh, but in this city is located a port. And as I understood from before, here is like free trade zone. So right now we are at the exhibition about all of this. <laughs> Now we are like at the port, the real one, and it's like this free trade port. So we have like real ships here, and this one is about to go away. And also we have like a conversation with an expert here, and uh, he's talking about this place and everything, and everyone can ask their questions about international trade and things. So right now we are like in the other part of the port, I think, like I asked them, is it a park like or something? And they said, no, it actually belongs to the port. So like the government spends a lot of money to build this place. So I think you can observe everything in the comfortable conditions and they gave us time to walk around this place for like 20 minutes and after that we will go for lunch i think and after the lunch we will go to another city uh suzhou it's not even 12 pm it's just like morning So right now we are going to have lunch. After we will go to Suzhou Museum and one famous street. Actually, as I said before, we have like special tags where we have all the plan for every day. So now is the lunch time.
so right now we are in Suzhou and we are at Pingdianlu. So it's Pingdian Street, like the oldest street of Suzhou and it's like really popular sightseeing. Let's go and check it inside because it's like really beautiful and it already gives the historical vibes. But here's a lot of people and it looks a bit crowded but it's a touristic place. So you can just actually wondering what is that and why I'm here, what is why it's looking like that. Like but this is actually like the oldest street of this city. So it's like really narrow and here is a lot of people because it's historical place. Let's go together. But right now there is like only a modern or some kind of little shops and food courts that, where you can buy something yeah but historically it also was a street right here This street is really old, but here is a lot of souvenir shops and uh, like something what's just for tourists and it kills the vibe of like history. And also some people are still living here because I saw the woman, she was like riding on the bike out of the place like where she was staying. So, but that's it actually, the street is over. Like, it's just one line, I think. Yeah, you can see how old the buildings are. But I would rather walk there without all the souvenir shops and everything, because it's a little bit... Nah, I don't like it. Now we just was at the place, uh, like the old street, and the atmosphere there was like really calm, chill, and it was just a pleasure to walk around. 
absorb and I feel like I had rest for this in these two days like finally when because we could spend the time on our own it was so cool like I really recommend you this place if you will be in Suzhou for sure and right now we are going to have dinner but I like I feel like this day was so quick like I didn't even notice because yesterday I was so tired but now I feel like energy after this place walking there and look at the restaurant like it's inside the restaurant it's So this is actually the hotel where we're gonna stay and it looks good now so i hope it's gonna be i think yes i'm not like hoping it is gonna be really good like rooms and everything let's go let's go for room tour i'm like really excited to see where i'm gonna sleep today because i didn't choose it yeah like one more thing i'm gonna tell you that all of this it was provided by our university for free like it's just so cool that we have opportunities like that oh <gasps> wow wait today and actually the bathroom has the thing so we can cover I don't know I'm sorry I'm they speak in Chinese I'm speaking English I'm also a bit lost and I'm tired but I'm happy tired and I will rest and see you tomorrow for our last day of the trip bye